it, Paul? How do you sum that one up? Well, I mean, the first thing I'll say, it's a huge improvement on last week. Um, that's, that's the first thing, but sadly we've come away with nothing again. I think we've been done by a real bit of quality for the first goal for the equaliser. Um, the second goal is disappointing because it's, it's not really come from anything and we've allowed him to come inside and get a shot on target when we've got to send him down the line there, which again, same thing we talked about last week. Um, real simple, simple defending things. Um, we've had opportunities. I mean, the scramble in the 18 yard, in the six yard box from the corner at 1-1 you have to stick that in the back of the net. We've had two or three bites of the cherry and, and not been able to score. So, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm disappointed, obviously, to have lost the game, disappointed we've come away with nothing again. Um, but there certainly was a, a vast improvement about the way the players went about it today. And I thought there was some some good, good passages of play where we got ourselves into good areas, but we just weren't able to get that final finish for us, ourselves again. Started the game well and actually got the goal we deserved this week yeah. as well. Yeah, I thought we did start the game really well, um, but I think we've done that on a few occasions. Um, and we got ourselves in front and then they had a little bit of a spell. And, and as I said, the goal the goal's real quality from Brown. He's a great bit of skill and it's a, it's a sort of finish that Chris Martin's done all of his career. And I think, you know, he showed his quality up against us today, Chris Martin. And they... they, they um, they, they give us some issues when balls went up to him, but on, on the flip side, I thought we caused them problems as well. I thought we were patient the way we passed the ball, we got ourselves wide, we got full-backs joining in and overloading, which we talked about before the game, um, because we just said we've got to we've got to go and be positive. And we got ourselves into onto some good transition situations with Jordan Gibson and Jack Diamond, and we didn't we didn't complete it properly, we didn't get that pass off which you know, again, it's, it's something that we've talked about all season, unfortunately. Both of the, their goals came after we'd had just good chances to score. Taylor hit the post in that corner that you mentioned. Yeah, those are the fine margins, aren't there? And you have to finish it off. You know, that's what I, I talked about last night when I was in front of the, the, the southern branch of the, the London branch and the South West supporters that, you know, we, we haven't been able to finish things off. And although we're getting into the right areas and getting into good areas, and not by luck, by some good football, um, but you have to finish things. You've got to, you've got to get, get that little bit of quality on the end or even that little bit of luck, which we didn't have from the, the set play where we had three bites at it. Um, it's another game gone, but we've just got to keep working. Like you said, they definitely showed more pride and fight than they did last week. That has to give us belief going into Tuesday. Yeah, well, it, 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 whatever it does do, we have to do it that way. We've got to play with, a, with more desire than, than we did last week, and that's for sure. But today... Today was a, a there was a, a massive gulf between what we did last week and what we've done this week, and that's that's a pleasing thing for me. Um, but again, you know, we've lost the game, we've got nothing from it. Where maybe with a little bit more quality and a little bit of luck, we may have been able to finish it off. I, th I thought today there was some there was some good individual performances. I thought Josh Vella was excellent today, not just his goal. Harrison was, was combative again in midfield and keeps things ticking over. I thought Taylor Charters did OK coming back into the team. Jack Diamond showed flashes of what he can do, but we didn't get the end product from him. So there was some good things, um, but, but not enough. Uh, ben not in the squad today, was he one of the bumps and bruises that you mentioned this week? Yeah, Ben um, got a whack on his ankle again, so he had some um, some swelling there from last weekend, so he wasn't fit today. Um, they, we had a scan on him, and it's no, there's no damage that needs surgery or anything, so we're, we're hopeful that he'll join training this week, but we're just going to have to see how he goes um, and, and see whether he's fit for, fit for our next games. In training tomorrow, which wasn't based on today's result, but was that just a case of getting today out of the way so you can really focus on Burton on Monday? Well, we, I just felt as though it's the right thing to do to get him in tomorrow. We've got a long journey back. We need to get out, that out of the system so that we can start preparations properly on Monday um, and get prepared for Burton um, because that's the only thing we can do now. We've just got to keep trying to do things properly, um, try and gain some respect again in the way we go about it, which again, I think we've done today. Um, and make sure that we've, we're still playing for pride and playing, playing to try and achieve something um, and see what comes. But and lost at home today, so just hoping for another improved performance from our lot. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's what we've got to do. You know, we, we've had brilliant support here today and, and I think they appreciated what the players have tried to do today. Um, 
I do think we have played, we had some real good passages of football. Um, so we have to go to Burton and we've got to try and stem this rot that's in there and try and get ourselves back into getting a positive performance and any type of positive result to take into next weekend's game at home. We didn't get an away uh, number, but they stuck with us again. Oh, no, the fans are outstanding. You know, they, we, we have it every time we come away from home. So, um, you know, again, you know, I'm, I'm sorry that they haven't been able to see a, a result for us, um, but they stuck with us, and I think they stuck with us because they saw what the players were trying to do, and they kept fighting right through to the end. But unfortunately, we've got no rewards for it. Thank you.